Wait a second, there is a floor up there. Is that where they're coming from? Well, there's where the zombie is. Yeah, they must be coming from up there. How? Oh, sorry for the microphone knock. How am I going to get up there? Oh, bloody hell, really? Where did you come from? Wait, have, I haven't even been here, have I? Also, there's a zombie over there who's kind of wanting to come and say hello. I can take him, that's for sure. I haven't even been here. So all of this time I've been going around in circles and I haven't even been in all of the locations that I could have. Ah, such is the nature of the mineshaft. There is an awful lot of pathways in these places, there's an awful lot of directions to go in. But I've been over here. So what, did I kind of just go, no, I don't really feel like going up or something? In this direction? Kind of weird, but okay. So we can get ourselves to a slightly higher level with another chest. Ooh, painting. Uh, some wood, That's that's not bad. More melon. Don't really need what's in there. That's that's a full actual melon, which is kind of cool. And and obviously take the torches. All right. So it looks like last time I just kind of didn't go in all of the directions that we could have. But it still doesn't really help that much in the end because this is still a dead end. Oi, um, I should take the arrows as well. At least give myself some weaponry with that. So I'm still kind of a little bit not sure. But I know if I know a bit more than what I used to. I know there's a gap in the ceiling which I should probably try and get up. Only I need to remember where that is now. Dang it! Why are these places so difficult to navigate? I should probably just follow the moaning zombie and I'll find it easily enough. Yeah, it was like... That's a slime! Oh hey, so there's slimes in this area as well. That's kinda cool. Depending on their size, the slimes tend to split up into smaller pieces. That one was already the smallest piece, so it kind of didn't split up any further. Uh, the slime balls are used for a couple of things, but mostly for creating sticky pistons, which I don't think we're gonna see for a fair while. But they're interesting nonetheless. Dang it, where was that gap? I don't know. Oh, I really hate these places so much. There's just so many place areas that you can go in and get lost in and just general confusion and I hate it all. Oh, this is back at the ravine, so... Yeah. That happened, I guess. I need to find where that... Oh, God! Um... I wasn't expecting that. Um... <laughs> Well, I could just go down and ignore the mine. I'm actually sort of curious to see what would be down here, but at the same time, I want—I really want to take revenge on them bleeding cave spiders. Like that—that that is my, my number one motivation at the moment: is getting rid of those stupid cave spiders. Yeah, watch the floor, guys, because the floor can sometimes deceive you. That's the last time I walk blindly in that area. Hmm. Right. Seriously, where was that one hole in the f in the ceiling? Because this is just right back at the start, which does mean I can put away the diamonds so that I don't lose it. And the slime balls, we'll put those away. 
Uh, but I, I, I just don't know. Oh, it was right here. Okay, so then, how to go about this? I should probably take apart some of the wood. And this uh, this is definitely my ticket to getting my revenge on them cave spiders, and that's all that matters at this point. Stupid cave spiders, seriously. Uh, can I stick a torch up there? That would be most appreciated if I could stick a torch up there. Although there might already be a torch up there, I don't know. But I want I want one of my own up there, somewhere. And that'll do. So I guess with this I could do that, which is all right. And then, well, the dirt the dirt's always the way forward. This if I do that and then that, that gives me a tunnel up. It's not really a tunnel; it's just a, a thing. But it's still there. And this is a brand new floor in this dungeon of sorts. It's basically a dungeon. You know, mineshaft stuff is always effectively that. Which is probably why I don't like them as much as I maybe could. But oh well. Uh, this is just a dead end though. Really? I've th There's got to be a way for me to get further along this. I must kill those friggin spiders. I will not take no for an answer. That is it. They are going down. There is no other way that this has to go. I don't care if it takes me all day. I am taking those spiders out, man. But I do kind of want to see what else is up here. Some more hostiles over there. Some more lava. A skeleton. Nah, I don't care enough. I think it kind of cares a little bit about me at this point. Let's see. Over there, the, it probably continues in that direction, but I don't care enough right now. And I got, like, completely frame stopping there for some reason. That was most annoying. Hmm. Is this really just another dead end? Also, yeah, placing a torch down causes updates to the blocks around it so that if the if there's a weird situation like gravel or sand, which was generated in a place that it couldn't physically stay, it just kind of tumbles down. The same happens if you place regular blocks and such as well. Man, there has got to be a way for me to reach where those bloody spiders were. But I'm just not seeing it. I don't know, weren't they like over there somewhere? I guess we've got to go this way. You know what? You what? Ah, there's no point now. If you're just gonna walk over to me, then I'm just gonna do that. I was going to, I was going to engage you in a firefight, but if you're just gonna do that, then you know, up yours. Uh, this this place, so many ways to go. I'm pretty sure the cave spider. Oh, well, hello there, gold, and so many melons. Wow, there is a lot of stuff here. Usually, I don't find that many chests in these places. I'm getting pretty lucky in that respect. A uh, zombie is this way, somewhere, I think. To be honest, I don't really care too much. That can just stay as it is. Is 
So, is there anything over here? No, of course there isn't. I really want... Where are those friggin' spiders? Like, that? they just need to get their asses over here. I need to kick their asses so badly for what they did last time. Just, yeah. Maybe I've got to dig out in a direction and find them. Find them that way. I suppose if I dig this. And keep on going in this direction, see if there's anything over here. I think there is. I just get that sneaking suspicion that there is something over here. It's just going to take a little bit of effort to get across. Yeah, there's totally like a skeleton over the other side of that. You can hear him. He's just there, waiting, like a jerk. Like, hey, I know you're coming, I'm just gonna stand here and I'm going to look pretty until you make a way towards, you know, in, in the pathway, so that I can just snipe you, like that. See? Told you. Just gonna have to tank the hits. It's not that big a deal, it's... Uh, if I have my shovel out, this would go a lot faster, so... Yeah. I think I'm going to keep hold of this gravel though, because the gravel is necessary for making flint. It's the only way that you can get flint, and flint is the one of the major components for making arrows. So flint, kind of important. Aha, now this seems a little bit more promising. Of course, until that happened, and then it's just a dead end. Man, how am I supposed to reach them spiders? Seriously, there's like no way of getting to them. This is the worst thing. Well, this is a very unusual place. I suppose it leads out here, but it just kind of exists. There's not really anything here. It's just a vertical part of the shaft, I guess. You know what? Right now, it looks like the pathway continues downwards for a bit. I mean, this is just a dead end, but there was another path down to the um, this bit here. As much as I want to kill those spiders, I'm fairly sure there's going to be more where they came from later on. So, yeah, let's let's just go with this section down here. This is at the bottom of the massive like canyon thing. Because as you see, this is where we came in. So it's yeah, the, there's more to explore down in this bit and we are fairly low down at this point. So there is every potential for there to just be a dead end. Damn it. Ah oh. That that's disappointing, seriously. There was supposed to be stuff there. I can't complain too much, I guess, because we did get quite a bit of stuff before, but even so. Come on, let me up. Thank you. I just want to see if there's anything else of note down the base of this canyon now.
which is not the case here, sort of unfortunate. I have a feeling there's going to be quite a few monsters going up the other side, but oh well. Round this way we go. Because I, I, I am curious now to see if there is anything of value down here. Ah, hello. You were kind of a little bit ineffective there, guy. Uh, yeah. He's gonna try and swim up to reach me again, though, but you know what? He can't do that because he's a zombie, and zombies just. yeah. I suppose he could technically go up and try and get to me like that, but oh well. Uh, I don't think he will. So let's dig over here because there's a skeleton who wants to join his uh, pile down there, but you know what? I can shoot him from here if I so desire. If he comes back into view, which he won't now because he's a jerk like that. Yeah, I I was going to shoot him, but apparently he just decided, nope, I'm going to go down there and I'm going to join my zombie power and there is a spider. Well, I'm going to shoot you, if for no other reason than to get revenge for the other friggin' spiders earlier. Which I did manage to kill it as well, how about that? So, eh, get down there fairly safely. Just be careful, there could well be more where that spider came from. It looks to be somewhat safe at the moment. And just seeing on the map, it's like all the hostiles are outside. That was a bad place to put the torch. All of the um, hostile mobs seem to be out of the canyon, they're not inside. So that's good. And then it just kind of goes into this. Which I'm sure is all wonderful in its own right, because it just goes on down, and down, and not down. Ah, oh, but then it, it sort of kind of loops around. What a weird place. So that was a nice little circular detour, I'm sure. It's down here, apart from a skeleton I can hear. Oh god, Jesus Christ. Bit close, bit close, but that's okay. This is why you need to be a bit more careful than I'm being at the moment. For some reason I'm being rather reckless, and that's not my usual style with this. Oh, yeah, see? Too reckless. But it's fine. I'm still alive, I saw the zombie there, so that's all good. Down here... Doesn't really look like there's that much of anything. Except a giant hole. There's a block of grass. Why is there a block of grass down here? Speaking of stuff down here, why is there a chest here? That's not natural. Oh! That's the problem with friggin' everything. And that's what happens when a creeper explodes. Yeah, I tend to, if I end up getting caught by surprise of stuff, I sort of flail around a little bit, which is not very helpful, I will admit, but that's sort of what I do, and we must live with that. So I just wanted to secure the area a little bit more, and it's precisely because of things like that that make me want to secure it. Uh... Well, I think that's not safe enough. Look at that. See if I'd have just kept on going without any care, that guy would have probably hit me. And been just about as frightening as the creeper. I've really got to get torches over here. Because I just need to have this place lit up. If I don't have this place lit up, stuff is just going to come and kill me. 
which I don't want. Really, really weird area. Very open area as well. This is exactly the type of place which I do not like because it's just so open-ended. Yeah, there's there's a lot of places that enemies can come from in this type of zone, and I am not a fan of it in the slightest. There's probably a zombie up there that wants to come down and attack. And there's a skeleton over there. Yay! It's a veritable army of foes, and you know what? I don't care, because I can just shoot him. Arrows, man, they are useful. I don't have very many torches left. That's not quite so useful. Well, I think it's just about safe enough at this point. Let's see what's in this chest. Oh, wow. Um, well, torches. Torches are always good. Uh, wooden planks. I guess I'll take those. Steak. Uh, fresh bow. I don't really need a fresh bow. I'm going to take the sticks, though. Obviously don't need rotten flesh in the slightest. Uh, you know what, might as well take it. It's not doing any harm, and... yeah. So, I... I don't have any idea why there's a random chest. I don't have any idea why there's a random zombie, which didn't really scare me as much as I expected, but yeah. Just a chest that decided to be around in the middle of a cave where nobody could have possibly put it. Huh. Wonder if there's any more like that. It's a distinct possibility. I mean, if there's one chest just randomly lying around, there could be more. But I don't think I'm going to explore too much more in this area right now. If there's going to, well, maybe if I want to try and get over the other side of the canyon. Hello. And there's a spider over there as well. Let's go say hi to the spider once I'm done with this dude. And we'll say hi to the spider with, wow, well, what have I got more of? I've got more bolts still, so we'll say hi to the spider using bolts. Why the hell not? Oh wow, it only took two hits this time. It's unusual. So, what else is over here? Like, anything of interest? No? Well, I say that prematurely, but I, I don't see it. I mean, we already went the other side of the mine. Which, there is still more to explore, but right now... <laughs> I don't I don't know, I just... I don't really feel it at the moment. I don't feel like that's a good idea. Just going in... Yeah, there's, there's nothing here. Alright, let's 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 find another, another place to explore for a little bit then. Like over here, because this place is totally not somewhere we've been. A uh, skeleton. I'm not afraid of skeletons unless they sneak up on me where I can't see them. Quite interested to see what the lava down here is all about, though. Maybe not that interested. Ugh, that that just looks horrible. You're not scaring anyone, Mr. Zombie. You're just not. I'm, I, I hate to say it, I know it's your job, and I know you take it very seriously, but you're not scaring anyone with that little act. And there is one down there as well. You know what? Don't care. Oh, but it's nearly night time outside, and it's... That's not a good time to start exploring anywhere. Well, anywhere outside, obviously. Uh, I want up here, thank you. Except there's nothing over here anyway. Wow, this place is kind of restricted, isn't it? 
See, usually when I find ravines and canyons and such like, they tend to have a, you know, cave at either side of them. So this place is being kind of barren at the moment, I'm not going to lie. No, what can you really do? It's it's not for you to decide what is and isn't in the place. Ah, crap. That was totally not a good idea, because there were dudes down here earlier. I guess there's not dudes down here now, so you know what? Let's go see what this place is like. More exploration, because why not? Ah, oh, that's where the lava was. Okay. Still not really sure how much I care about the lava. But it has found us some redstone. I guess this is a decent place to get down if you're wanting. Oh, there's totally dudes up there. I know there are dudes up there, so you know, I don't care. You guys can just stay up there. But yeah, we're down at a deep enough level that, again, if we were lucky enough, we could find diamond. There is always that possibility. That's the main allure of coming down into this level, I guess, is the fact that diamonds can be found. And the spider can jump that gap and not be affected by the lava. That is just annoying. So you know what? Just burn. I don't even care about the experience. It's just the sheer fact of the spider could jump that gap and not care about the lava. Just kind of rude, man. Just kind of rude. Now is another freaking cave expanse. Really now. Yeah, this place is so much bigger than the cave I was in at my other at my house. Huh? It's my absolute least favorite kind of cave as well. They're just every single pathway goes into about seven more pathways. And it just... Yeah, it, it's just so much confusion. So much getting lost. There's something over there and I don't really care enough to get it. Oh well. Um, yeah, I think this is a good enough place to leave at the moment. I don't really fancy staying down here. And, well, the search for a new home place continues, I guess.